welcome to Horrorverse. My name is Cody Hawk, and today we're going to be talking about Zombie Land 2 that just came out last week. Uh, me, my wife, and my friend just watched it, not even 20 minutes ago, so I wanted to help get this review up for you guys so you guys can know what's going on with this movie. Um, I feel like I might be in the minority for this movie, honestly, after talking with my friend who watched it with us. Um, starring the original four from the first movie, which is Jesse Eisenberg, Woody Harrelson, Emma Stone, and the younger sister, which I don't remember her name. Um, so it's got them back. Um, it's got a little Bill Murray cameo for you guys that like Bill Murray. It's um, actually an in credit scene. I'm not going to tell you what it is, but definitely stay. Um, it, it's like right when the credit starts. You don't stay much longer after the movie. Um, I really enjoyed this movie. I loved it. Um, and that's kind of where I'm in the minority with, I don't know about other people, but at least with my friends so far. And you guys might hate this, but I actually enjoyed this movie more than the first one. Now, let me explain. Give me, give, let me give you some <laughs> reasonings there. Um, Zombieland is a great movie. I've already reviewed it once. I don't actually remember what I, re what I gave that rate, what I rated that one. Um, I know, I think I did like a nine, because at that point I was doing numbers. And I've changed it since then. Um, but there's a lot of nostalgia for Zombieland 1, and there's still things that are better in Zombieland 1, where it has, and what I mean by that is that it was kind of its own thing, you know, it, the way the type of movie it was, it knew what it wanted to do, and it was its first, you know, I don't, I don't know how to <laughs> explain it, but what I mean is like, this is a sequel, you know, and they're taking all the great things from Zombieland 1 and putting them in this one, so it's not like they're coming out with their own ideas they're taking it from the first movie so you gotta kind of you know hold credit to the, the first zombie land for that that the reason this one is so good is because it's taking the best parts from the original um now by saying that i do think this one was a lot more funny the jokes were 10 times better in this one and i think that's because zombie land one where it was funny it was meant to be funny it was kind of like that dark comedy funny where it was more like awkward moments and the characters weren't meaning to be funny it's just the circumstance if that makes sense whereas this one they were straight up making jokes they were making hilarious jokes while all this stuff's going on while zombies are attacking them like it was almost a parody of zombie land one to an extent at least in my personal opinion um so you could see that as a bad thing or a good thing you know whether depending on what you saw zombie land as I saw it as a comedy horror, and that's what this one is, so obviously why not make fun of the original one? They make some puns from the original, making fun of stuff that happened in the original and things they said. Um, I enjoyed that. Some of the new characters, while they were they were dumb, like there's one chick in the new character in the movie that's a complete idiot. I, d I hated the character, but she definitely added some more funny moments to the movie. Um, so I think this was a lot more funny. Um, it also, I think, had a little more action, better looking action, bigger action. Whereas in the original, the main action scene was at the very end, you know, at the carnival or at the um, amusement park. This one, it's kind of spread apart through the whole movie. Like, you got the, kind of the same intro as the original one, where it had the slow motion zombies, people, them killing people, you know, with the music playing. And in this one, you had the same kind of concept, the slow motion music, but it was your main characters killing zombie, which I thought was a little bit cooler. Um, you also had a f few decently big action scenes kind of in between every, you know, 30 minutes or so. Whereas the other one, there was a lot more just talking and, you know, funny moments. This one, there's still some more action. So, I mean, just right there, it's more funny in my opinion, and there's more action scenes. Those two things. All right, so I really got to start remembering to charge this camera because it died again so I had to plug it up real quick um, so I kind of lost track where I was at um, but like I said I mean I, I just enjoyed this one more I mean those two reasons and then I don't know why um, I don't think I saw the original zombie land theater so maybe the theat theater experience you know kind of pushed a little bit more um, I, I really don't know I mean Jesse Eisenberg Emma Stone all four of them I mean really everyone in this movie did great fantastic job in casting and acting um, Woody Harrelson, fucking hilarious. I mean, nonstop through this whole movie. Um, I mean, there are a couple of scenes in here that seem like they're going 
like if I want to do some negatives, I guess, is where they're going too far on the parody. Like you see in the trailer where they meet some people that's like they're clones, you know, they're copies of yourself. Like I felt like that was going a little too far on the parody concept. Um, but really besides, I mean, that's my biggest complaint. I mean, I wish I could sit here and think and nitpick a bunch of things and I might do that later on. So there's a hair or something. <laughs> um, but I might do that later on, but I just want to get the review out for you guys, to, you know, for you to know, um, you know, and if you seem like, if you think you have the same taste as me, then definitely go check this movie out. Don't wait till it comes out on DVD. Go to theaters and check it out. I know in my, my town, there's only three showings a day. I don't know, I don't know if they just didn't expect to be a big movie or what. Um, so that kind of sucked. Um, but yeah, I mean, like I said, I could probably nitpick some more things. I really sat down and thought about it. And that's kind of one of the other reasons I want to help get this review out because I enjoy this movie. I love the movie. And I know if I sit down and be like, well, did I like that part? But it doesn't matter because it's a funny movie. It's a horror movie, but it's a comedy. In comedies, you don't have to overthink them as much. That's kind of why I like, one of the reasons I like, like the horror genre so much is, yeah, some of them you can, like The Shining, you know, the extra stuff like that. There's, the, you know, they're very, you know, thought-provoking movies. But a lot of the horror genres not. It's just there to entertain you. You know, you don't have to sit there and really overthink it. And so this is where this movie kind of hit both, you know, comedy and horror aspect. You don't have to overthink the movie. It's silly. It's ridiculous. But it's still great. Um, so definitely go check it out. Uh, I don't know how long it'll be in theaters. Like I said, it seems like it's didn't get as big a release, at least where I live at. So I don't know. You might want to check into that. Um, and like I said, I don't remember what I did. For Zombieland, the original one, like I said, I know I did a number grade, and I probably did an eight or nine. I can't remember. Um, and I'm not gonna say this movie is you know an A or an A plus, um, just because, like I said, I still enjoyed it, but there are some problems with it, and just the type of movie it is. I mean, like I said, I, you know, excuse me. Um, like I said, it's a few things wrong, but overall, it's just a fun movie to sit down and enjoy. And I'll definitely rewatch it again when it comes out. Um, but so I think for Zombieland Double Tap, I'm going to go with a B minus. Um, like I said, that might be not as good as I'm going to, like I might want a lower grade later on, or I might want a higher grade, but that's what I'm sticking with, a B minus, which I feel like is still a solid grade for a movie. Um, especially nowadays where most movies that come out are just shit. Um, so go check Zombieland Double Tap out. Hope you guys enjoyed the review, and I'll see you in the next one.